about time. What's up, money geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. In this video, we are going to talk about the elephant in the room. Yes, Dogecoin is the elephant in the room. So I want us to talk about it because I've been getting a lot of questions from you guys asking if we should buy, where to buy, and all that good stuff. So let's talk about Dogecoin. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. If that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, Dogecoin has been trending online for the past uh, four days or so, four or five days or so um, because of tweets from Elon Musk. So I'm going to bring up some of the tweets here that he actually put out there. So if you can see here, Moss tweeted, he says, no high, no lows, only Doge. And then it's like, who let the Doge out? So he's definitely talking about Dogecoin. And each time he tweets, people respond to the tweet and people are uh, heading out there and buying Dogecoin. So what is Dogecoin? before we even like said, you know, talking about if you should buy it or not. So Dogecoin is kind of like a digital currency. Um, if you can see here, that does a peer to peer digital currency that enables you to easily send money online. So again, it just gives you the opportunity to be able to send money to people, to friends, um, to creators um, uh, across the country, across uh, the continent, uh, without any middleman, without a bank or anything that will take fees. So you can send money directly to your favorite charity, knowing fully where that charity is going to receive the exact amount that you wanted to send them. Or you can send money to your favorite creator, um, not worrying about them going through Patreon and Patreon taking a cut of the money. You can send and give them money directly to support their work. So that is the, the basis of the currency. So if you look from that perspective, there is an actual use case for it. Um, the only the only thing that is I'm looking here is that uh, people are adopting that use case um, and really going with it because I know there's other coins or uh, cryptocurrencies that do the exact same thing that you can use for payments and everything. So even Bitcoin, you can do um, the exact same thing. So, uh, but Bitcoin has a better reputation than than Dogecoin. Uh, the reason why Dogecoin has been on you now again trending is just because Elon Musk talks about it. So each time he touches something, it turns into gold pretty much. So if you want to turn into gold, tell Elon Musk to tweet about you. You are going to turn into gold. Again, that is the, the you know the use case for the cryptocurrency. Um, and so if we look at the currency here prior to this craziness, look at what the thing was sitting at price wise. I mean, like it was, it barely had any recognition, nothing whatsoever. And then as soon as Mars started talking about it, the thing has gone up. If we can see here, the last month alone, it's gone up 760%, which is insane. Um, other coins they haven't even moved that much, uh, but Dogecoin has actually, you know, just gotten that publicity and people are still looking to buy it. So uh, if you are probably asking yourself, but yes, I want to get into it. I mean, I want to enjoy that hype and make some profit, which is good. If you have money that you want to risk and at least, in, I mean, it's high risk, high reward. So let's say you have $500 that if you lose tomorrow, you don't really care about. I would say drop it in there and take your chances. Like, hey, I mean, the most you can lose is that $500 that you put in there. So uh, drop it in there, take your chances. So where can you buy Dogecoin? Definitely you can buy Dogecoin on platforms like uh, Robinhood, on platforms like Binance, platforms like Kraken. Um, that's, those are the three that I know for sure. Now Coinbase just uh, recently added them um, to their portfolio. So definitely check Coinbase as well. Uh, people that are trading using Weibo, Weibo currently doesn't support Dogecoin. I don't know if they plan on bringing in the, the currency because I mean, it's like one of the hardest cryptocurrencies out there. So if they plan on bringing it to their platform, um, I think it would be a great idea. Um, then I don't know which other platforms that support it, but for the most part, again, it'd be Binance, Robinhood, and Kraken that support or the buying and selling of Dogecoin. So definitely go check them out. So again, I wanted to just bring this one to you guys. Again, when you get into um, cryptocurrency, know fully with that the volatility of the market is insane. This thing can go from where it's currently trading right now to like zero in less than no time. And so you, you have to be aware of that. And um, besides, there's really no regulations about it out there. So if, you, if you're if you dealing with it, you put money in there, don't think that, you know, 
the money is FDIC insured or protected in any shape or form. It's just like you putting money in a black box. You don't really know what's in that box. It could be, there could be a, a monster in the box that it's money and it, it's your money. You're never going to see it. That's the risk that you take with it. Uh, on the flip side, the rewards are incredible. I've seen people that had some money in, in Dogecoin from the early days. And then now a thousand dollars is actually transformed into five or six, seven thousand dollars just like that. Uh, but the flip side again, guys, is uh, when there is momentum like this, the people that got in early are the ones that are going to enjoy it. Because as soon as this thing, if you jump in now and then this thing just like uh, slow down and starts to pull back, you're going to sit in there in the red because you got in at the tip. So uh, for this, I would say look for a good entry point, wait for a pullback. Uh, if we go back to the charts here, you can see where it gives people opportunity to get in. So if you see here how there's a dip, like you look look for these dips right here those are the places where you want to get into the stock so like right now it's pulling back a little bit so you can say okay you want to buy this thing under uh let's say eight cents and then so you put your you put your your buy order and wait for it to come down under eight cents and then you can jump in and pick it up so that is that would be a good approach to to get in but again guys make sure that the money that you're putting in there is money that you don't really care losing if things were to go south you're very comfortable losing that money and not, not sweating about it so that's what i wanted to cover in this video so if you have any questions again guys let me know in the comment section if you're new to the channel we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content also if you're looking to get started with investing guys uh webo is still doing their promotion where if you sign up and deposit hundred dollars you get some free stocks links in the description and as always guys do your due diligence don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated